Thank you for tuning in to another video by Chef Denis. Today we are making one of my new favorite things, which is spaghetti squash. So spaghetti squash has been really popular lately, and if you're anything like me, you're like, oh, I don't know, I don't like squash, am I gonna like it, blah blah blah. Anyways, I bought one, I tried it, I love it, so there you go. One thing I will say is that they are very difficult to cut, so make sure you have a heavy and very sharp knife to cut it. After you cut it, you're going to scoop the seeds out of the middle, just like you would with a pumpkin. After the inside's all cleaned up, you're going to bake at 375 for about 40 to 45 minutes. Put some olive oil on the inside of your squash, and then you're also going to add your salt and your pepper. Okay, so now that you have seasoned your squash, you are going to flip it over. This part is important for the cooking process because it helps trap the steam and make it get soft faster. So now I'm going to add my chopped up garlic, onion, and peppers into a hot pan with olive oil. I'm going to let that cook by itself in the hot pan for just about two or three minutes. And then next I'm going to take it out of that pan and put it off to the side while I cook the meat. Okay, so next we're going to add our ground meat into the same pan that our vegetables were cooked in. I'm going to chop it up real nice, make sure it is evenly cooking. When that's about halfway cooked, you can go ahead and start adding your favorite seasonings. Here I kept it pretty simple, I just added some paprika, some black pepper, and some seasoning salt. And then I added the vegetables back to the pan with the meat. So then next I let that cook all together until it's completely done. And then now I am adding in my tomato sauce. This carbone one is so good, definitely one of my favorites. Now I'm letting the meat and the vegetables all cook together in the sauce. Let it simmer for about five to 10 minutes and then it's ready for you. So you're gonna take your spaghetti squash out of the oven and you're gonna flip it over and it's gonna be nice and steamy. That means it's ready for you. Now I'm gonna show you two different things here. When you flip it over, you can start shredding it immediately, but it will produce a lot of water this way. I did learn that. Um, there's another video coming up here where I let it cool all the way down and it shredded a lot easier and it didn't get as watery. So whichever is your preference, you do that, but I thought I would show both options. So here's the video where I let it cool all the way down. You can see that the shreds are a lot bigger. It's not as wet. Um, I think I do actually prefer it this way. <laughs> So then next, you just add your spaghetti right on top of it. You use the skin of it as a bowl, and that's it. You've got yourself a low-carb, high-flavor dinner. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.